Kawasaki has officially announced its intention to revive the iconic two-stroke engine, a bold move that has stirred excitement among motorcycle enthusiasts and environmentalists alike. At a time when sustainability and innovation are redefining the automotive world, Kawasaki is challenging conventions by reimagining a technology long considered obsolete. This revival is not just a nostalgic return but a forward-looking vision that blends tradition with cutting-edge advancements. The spotlight of this comeback shines brightest at the 2025 Japan International Expo, also known as the Osaka Expo. At the center of Kawasaki's exhibit is a groundbreaking machine called Corleo, a futuristic off-road vehicle and vision for the year 2050. Unlike anything seen before, Corleo isn't equipped with wheels, it walks on four legs and is ridden like a motorcycle. This bizarre yet fascinating design pushes the limits of personal mobility and offers a glimpse into what the future of adventure riding might look like. But even more intriguing than the design is the power source hiding inside this robotic beast. According to Japanese automotive magazine, Young Machine, the Corleo is powered by a revolutionary 150 cubic centimeters two-stroke turbocharged hydrogen engine. Yes, it's a two-stroke engine, something that nearly vanished due to its environmental impact. In the past, these engines were criticized for emitting large amounts of pollutants, as they burned oil mixed with gasoline. However, Kawasaki's solution to this problem is both brilliant and futuristic. Replacing fossil fuels with hydrogen, which, in theory, only produces water vapor as exhaust. But the challenge lies in lubrication. Traditional two-stroke engines require engine oil to be burned along with the fuel mixture to keep the crankshaft running smoothly. Even when using hydrogen, burning oil would still release CO2. Kawasaki tackles this issue by incorporating turbocharging technology, which allows the engine to compress the air-fuel mixture externally rather than within the crankcase. This clever engineering eliminates the need to mix oil into the combustion process. By doing so, Kawasaki is on track to create a truly zero-emission two-stroke engine, one that runs clean on hydrogen without sacrificing performance. While it may sound futuristic or even experimental, turbocharged two-stroke engines are already in use in military tanks and large marine vessels. The technology is real, and Kawasaki is determined to bring it to smaller, personal vehicles. The hydrogen engine in the Corleo, dubbed Cuvoid, is still under development, with Kawasaki Heavy Industries aiming to commercialize it in the near future. While its initial use may be as a generator, the possibilities for expansion are promising. It's likely that Kawasaki intends to bring this new power unit to motorcycles, marking a radical step forward in performance-oriented green mobility. For riders like me, the return of the two-stroke engine, now cleaner and more efficient than ever, is thrilling. It wasn't long ago that Kawasaki dropped a teaser video suggesting this very revival, igniting speculation and hope across the motorcycle world.